Psalm 27 The Lord is my light and my salvation. Whom shall I fear? The Lord is the strength of my life. Of whom shall I be afraid? When the wicked, even mine enemies and my foes, came upon me to eat up my flesh, they stumbled and fell. Alright, Shalom. First and foremost, I would like to give all praise and glory unto Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shah, Bahashem, Rakakwadash, and double honors unto the apostles and the elders of GMS who rule well, teach well, being great examples to his younger brothers, and peace and blessing salutations to the whole flock out there pushing his word in truth and in sincerity across the four winds. In the name of Yahweh Bashem Al Shah, pushing to get up out of here. Shalom on to the whole flag, the believers, the listeners, who may have came back to the obedience of the scriptures through faith in Yahweh Bashem Al Shah. All right, and what I want to get into today, you know, is the product, you know, speaks for itself. You know, and that's a term, you know, that's used in the world. <laughs> okay, as, you know, as a, as, a, as a marketing, you know, um, strategy. You know, speaking of how, you know, the product, you know, speaks for itself, you know, as, you know, we're that product in the spirit, you know, and the new creature that we're becoming should speak for itself, you know, because as you go into the scriptures, it's about, you know, a lot of things dealing with us, you know, that we have to continue to address. You know, as we look out to the world, of course, the world is <laughs> completely off. Okay, but why as we address particular things that's off with the world, we're still a work in progress. You know, and as we're constantly working on ourselves and developing, being developed in righteousness, you know, the product should begin to speak for itself. You know, and we're their product. And this is inspired, you know, by this lesson, this, uh, precept in the book of Matthew the 11th chapter Matthew 11 and 19 it says the son of the son of man and this is how I speaking on the other hand feast and drinks and you say he's a glutton and a drunkard and a friend of tax collectors and other sinners now we know one thing you know um, there's just a, uh, a portion of our people you know they can never be satisfied you know, to, you know, with Jake, you know, with some Jake, you can never, you know, be on point in their eyes. You know, they're always going to find something to criticize. And this is what Jake was doing. All right, here it is, you know, John the Baptist, you know, pretty much he was separated from society. You know, he didn't deal in the world. And they said he had demons on him. Okay. But yeah, how was shy? You know, he was in the midst, you know, of the people. Okay, teaching, you know, he, you know, and, and he was eating and drinking amongst, you know, the common Israelites. And now, you know, he's, he's a drunk, you know, and a glutton, you know. But at the end of the day, Jake wasn't dealing with the message. You see, Jake wasn't concerned with the message. You know, they just wanted to criticize, which, you know, you're going to have that, you know. And, and, and that's why we don't spend any time. Okay, on those, you know, who who don't get it. Okay, <laughs> you see, but there are some, okay, that are watching and seeing what we're becoming. And it's a chance they, 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 they can be converted, you know. And that's why Yahweh Shah said this. It says, but wisdom is shown to be right by its results. Okay. Wisdom is shown to be right by its results. And you look out into the world and all the talking points, you know, that we was mocked and scoffed, you know, and made us look foolish. Now, these are the talking points, okay, and alternative news, you know, some regular news headlines, okay, TikTok. Now, everyone is dancing to the tune of prophecy, okay, which the Lord you know, had us to be forerunners, beginning with our apostles and elders and their elders, 
okay, decades ago, okay, so as we, you know, entered, you know, into, all right, I, I, the, the, the thick <laughs> of prophecy, you know, as we're going into the climax of prophecy, okay, the results of what we're teaching is starting, you know, to show, okay, and also our personal development in this thing is starting to show, okay, because one thing about it, our people knew us in the world, okay, even if they don't agree, you know, with the doctrine or, you know, they think, you know, you know, Jake said we're in the cult and, you know, they're trying to downplay what we do, you know, it's not serious to them in, in no type of way, all right, but they should start seeing the results, you know, and which they can't be argued against because what we, we begin to eat better <laughs> okay well uh, men are becoming better fathers and husbands and you know uh, uh you know and not their traditional sense okay but according to the righteousness of the scriptures okay which we know you know as, as men you know sometimes a lot of times we're unavailable because of the ministry okay but we become more potent, you know, as, you know, fathers and husbands, just seeing how brothers deal, you know, you know, uh, in their day to day. Women are becoming better, you know, uh, wives, you know, or wives to be or, 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 or mothers, you know, it's undeniable. OK, which de by default, it puts the children in the best situation to win. You know, you have children being pretty much raised in the truth. Okay, so we see the results of nigger culture, and now the Lord has us seeing the results of following Him. Okay, and the product should, uh, is speaking for itself. Okay, so when we come here, because this wisdom has us being those new creatures. Okay, so when you go, um, go here I think it's 1st Corinthians 6 and all right matter of fact let's get this one real quick Compare there. all right this is Titus chapter 2 all right in verse 6 it says young men likewise exhort to be sober-minded okay or you read this in the NLT says in the same way encourage the young men to live wisely man okay brothers you know because even even you know brothers done uh, uh, the way you know just brothers conduct you know brothers have become more disciplined brothers are becoming more culture listening to different music you know really into the earth uh, you know uh we begin to what dominate you know the flesh our lust <laughs> you know and there's other people that's benefiting off our discipline like you know the product should be speaking for itself man living wisely man okay uh the desires for this world is fading you know and and, and the desires for the world to come is growing and it has us living wisely man okay Cause hey, we was into all type of things, man. Hanging out all night, okay, drinking, you know, on the scene, like you know, some brothers uh, more than others, but hey, we we was into all type of things, man. Especially brothers that you come into the truth around the same time, and you know, you don't see them for a while, then you see them, and it just, you know, their growth, <laughs> you know, you just notice their growth amongst brothers, man. You know, and that's how was shot dealing through this word man okay and then we begin to really live wisely man We're, we we start to become what we teach okay and it says and you yourself must be an example to them by doing good works of every kind let everything you do reflect the integrity and seriousness of your teaching we should be become we should become a product of what we what he, what we teach you know and then you notice you know certain people that mocked those same people start to try to eat like you try to fast like you you know asking you a question about you know the herbs 
okay <laughs> you become the go-to guy now you see <laughs> you see and that's how the lord to do it and it's not a thing of pride because when you first come in you know we get the we pretty much you know that zeal you know have us being you know a tyrant you know we go around our people okay point everything out and you know and, and then we learn to live you know with balance and this truth man like you just gotta let our people do what they gonna do you know well you know like you can't just sit there and just criticize everything they do and, you know pick arguments and all these different things like nah if you you know whenever you're around you know just keep it simple you know try to be less uh, um, try to have less controversy as possible, man. You know, scripture say lead, live peaceable with all men if possible, man. Now, some situations are just, you know, <laughs> so intense, and you know, some of our people do have demons on to where you can't just be around, them, you know. But just in general, even around our family or we out and about, you know, we should maneuver in a way, you know, that's that's um. That's that's that, that we should maneuver in a way that people that don't even know what we're a part of, you know, they, you know, should have nothing, you know, but you know, good things to say, you know, because we should show that pattern of good works when we read it in um, KJV, Titus two and seven says, in all things showing thyself a pattern of good works and doctrine showing uncorruptness gravity and, and, and sincerity man so we should have a pattern of good works man okay we should have a good name at certain places that we that we frequent frequent you know whether we shop or eat or you know <laughs> even that you know a uh, uh, certain you know line of work their brothers do some brothers you know personal trainers and all different you know, brothers into different things, you know, some brothers got their own, you know, business and, you know, we should have a pattern of good works, you know, we should be, you know, a, a, a people of high character, man, you know, we should be a people of high character, man, that's a, that's a trait of nobility, man, is that high character, man, integrity, <laughs> you know, uh, uh, you know, honesty, you know, in, 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 in you know, in dealing, Okay, <laughs> not being uh, a harm to anybody, man, but a plus. <laughs> you see, so let's go here. I want to end to hear this um, Colossians four and six. It said, "Let your speech be always with grace, seasoned with salt." When Fetham started uh, five, it says, "Walk in wisdom toward them that are without, redeeming the time." Okay, and you read this in verse 5, Colossians 4 and 5. Live wisely among those who are not believers and make the most of every opportunity, man. You know, so this is Apostle Paul giving advice to these Israelite foreigners that are waking up to the truth and coming back to righteousness, but they're still around, all right, a, a pagan worship. Okay, Jake, you know. They still around, you know, worldly, you know, defiled and just bugged out people, <laughs> you know, and they, they, their family, you know, they're probably the only one because we either the one or two, maybe two at the most, for the most part. You have certain whole families as far as husband, wife and, you know, children that believe. OK, but for the most part, you know, and that's your immediate family, but for the most part. Uh, you know out of our situation you know we're the one person you know out of our living family you know they believe you know so even at work you know you're probably that one person that believes you know a lot of times you're that one maybe two at the most in each environment so there's a way we have to conduct ourselves you know, not to bring blame to the ministry, okay? You know, not to be, you know what I'm saying, they're, they're, they're overbearing, okay, critical of everything. Like, nah, you got to let things be, you know, the Lord, 
got to set up, man. Let people play their role in the movie. And we're going to keep playing ours. And, 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 and even those that are without the unbelievers, there still should be a certain, you know, level of integrity that is shown towards them. Okay? It's not going to be on the level that we show believers because, you know, uh, we can't even deal with them on certain levels. <laughs> you see? But on just a surface level, you know, we should be, um, have a conduct that's a good representation, okay, of what we teach and what we believe, you know, being fair, <laughs> okay? Um, I say just, 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 you know, just, and just why you how was shy, you know, you like, look, if, if, um, you know, someone has to walk a mile, walk too, because in the, um, the Roman empire as a citizen of rome you know if a soldier you know asked you to carry you know pretty much he he pretty much uh had to be an arm bearer you know if a soldier told you to carry you know his gear you know for a mile you know you had you had to go a mile as a roman citizen you know so you have a side like if you asked to go a mile go too <laughs> you know like you don't just be an asshole out here. Now, don't be, you know, this society full of gimmicks. So, don't just be that one way in every situation. But in some circumstances, you know, hey, hey you in a position of help and it don't hurt you, man. You know, hey, it is what it is, you know. But you have to put that disclaimer. This is a very grimy society, so that can't apply in every single situation. You know, but in certain situations, you know, so if it, you can help without hurting, you know, it is what it is, you know. And it says, um, let your conversation be gracious and attractive so that you will have the right response, all right, for everyone, okay. So we're learning, you know, to have how conduct to be seasoned with salt, you know, which if something is seasoned right, it was delightful, you know. It's, 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 it's um, you know, it becomes a delight, you know, so at the end of the day, you know, we're here, you know, and as we wait on these prophecies, we should constantly start to become, you know, a product of this teaching and this wisdom, you know, and when you go into it, man, you, you know, you just have to really be a complete demon, you know, to be at odds with someone that's becoming a product of, of this wisdom of follower Yahweh you know and what you're gonna have that you know and play it according you see cause there's a balance in everything you know so I just want to get that you know Lord will you know you brothers and you sisters edified to the next time I say Shalom